do you know something I don't like? <laughs> you guys, I hate hairdressers that do not listen. Hairdressers that don't like to take instructions from their clients. I really, really dislike those kind of hairdressers. And you guys are probably like, ah, what happened, sister, this early morning, this early afternoon? What really happened? See, this thing is common with African hairdressers in particular. Honestly, I've not had my hair done by other Africans other than, let me say, um, mostly Nigerians. But as I came to this Canada, I encounter other Africans. <laughs> and I'm here to say that all of them, almost all of them, are practically the same thing. If you find a hairdresser that is not like this, then you are in luck. So I'm sure you guys are like, ah, what happened? What was the issue? Everything. You see, this is my hairstyle. <laughs> this hairstyle, I've had it for, let me say, just a couple of days, right? So I did it last week, Friday, and today is Wednesday. So let's say we're going up, up to like five days or so, right? Now, this hairdresser, she made my hair before. This is the second time of her making my hair. And the first time she made my hair, it was really, really nice. I was like, wow. If I can find the picture, I'll probably show you guys. I was like, wow, this hair is really nice. It lasted me for four weeks. It's cornrows. And generally, I don't even keep my cornrows for two for four weeks. But if I'm going to pay $40, <laughs> 40 Canadian dollars for cornrows that are going to cost me maximum of 1000 1500 naira in Nigeria, if I'm going to pay $40 for it, ah, it's not bad if the hair can last me for four weeks. So I was very happy. Next thing you know, you guys, the fourth week when I wanted to take this hair out, I discovered that it was pulling out all my front hair. And I'm like, you know, that's not good, okay? It's nice to have neat hair, but I don't want my hair to be falling out. So I tell this woman when I went back to her, like, last week Friday to say, okay, you know what? This time, can you please, like, you know, relax on the front? Like, don't pull it too tight. And you know she told me? <laughs> I'm tempted to tell you people what she told me in part two. It depends on whether this thing posts or not. But if not, you know, watch out for part two.